This is Mrs. Yanka reviewing lesson 1-1, variables and expressions. We talked about variables in this lesson being letters generally that stand for a value that can change or one that we don't know. And in lesson 1-1, we were asked to evaluate expressions. So if I gave you the expression 4x plus 9y and asked you to evaluate it for x equal to 2 and y equal to 5, I hope you would know what to do. Plug it in, plug it in. So what that looks like in this problem is 4, put your parentheses for your parking space, plus 9, put your other parentheses for your parking space, and now substitute the correct values in for those variables. Where x is, we need to substitute a 2. Where y is, we need to substitute a 5. And now, folks, don't forget GEMDAS, G-E-M-D-A-S, for order of operations. That's a set of rules that never goes away. So we need to do 4 times 2 is 8. We need to do 9 times 5, which is still 45. And lastly, we need to add these two numbers. Do you know what 8 plus 45 is? It is 53. We have evaluated our expression by substituting the correct values for the variables, followed order of operations, and we got our final answer. For more problems like this, check out Lesson 1-1 in your book.